Hi there. Welcome to my shop. This is where I'm creating a lot of the art that's for the upcoming art show. And uh, this is the update video for the art show. Alright, so I need you to start off by apologizing that this is another update uh, video on how the art show is coming along. You know, we're not doing something crazy out there like, you know, playing with kittens or something. No, uh, this is just an update to let you guys know that things are going good, that I'm still doing this, and you know, the plan is, the plan is there, yeah! But, uh, but I messed up. I did. I did. I did mess up. So, on the Facebook page there that I've posted the, uh, the art show and everything, it says, uh, Coffee Culture, which is correct, 129, which is also correct, but I wrote down St. Thomas Street South, when actually it's Thames South Street. Yes, say that again, Thames South Street, not St. Thomas Street. Yes, this wouldn't be so bad if I have not already made, uh, printed off about 300 posters, 1,200 little cards, and I've already handed out about maybe 60, 50 of them. Yes, so we are going to have to rectify that problem there. So, besides my horrendous spelling mistake, you're going to be able to expect a lot of those on this trip. On this two-year adventure here and whatnot, there's probably going to be a lot more spelling mistakes. And I apologize right now for all of them in a sense, but, you know, can't help that. Alright, so besides the spelling mistake, there are a few other people that I kind of want to give a shout out to. So, you can see a few of the other art pieces that I'm going to have in the show here, but this isn't really what I want to talk about. A lot of you people might have gotten a few uh, email messages from me saying that I was going to do a raffle draw and have baskets of goodies and stuff that I would raffle at this raffle draw. And that's true, I'm still going to have that. The art show is just separate from the raffle draw itself. So the art show is kind of just going towards raising money for this next fundraiser that I'm going to be doing, right? And uh, so I sent out a bunch of emails to people asking if they had any merch, like t-shirts, hats, maybe even bands that wanted to donate uh, their demo uh, CDs or maybe even their full, uh, full length CDs and whatnot. So just to make it clear, the art show is going to be separate from the raffle draw. So if you guys still know any businesses that would like to donate any kind of merch to this, uh, this fundraiser, I'd be more than glad to get them. Like, it would really help out. And to give a shout out to some of the people that have actually donated some stuff already. One second. <laughs> Laura Durston, who has a Facebook uh, page for her textiles, was an old friend of mine from Beale, was the art school that I went to way back in the day. So like I said, she uh, specializes in textiles and has donated four pairs of these mittens. Now what's really great about these mittens is the fact that one, they're really well made mittens, and two, made from used sweaters. Yeah, she makes them out of old worn out sweaters and makes really great mittens out of them. So kudos to you, Laura, and thank you for uh, donating them to me and the fundraiser. So, besides Laura's uh, donations to our raffle draw, we also have in our possession a signed copy of Pineville Heist. This is Lee Chambers' number one bestseller thriller. The very definition of thrill, says U.S. Review of Books. Huh. Lee Chambers was actually one of my teachers up in Confederation College. While teaching, he wrote this book called Pineville Heist and is now getting it off the ground as a movie. It's signed by him and the soon-to-be lead actor, Boo Boo. Yes, his name is Boo Boo. He's actually the brother of the one guy who played the werewolf in the Twilight Saga. Boo Boo actually uh, played one of the werewolves himself and I believe the second movie? I'm not too sure about that. Well, way to go for that one, Lee, and thank you for the donation. So, the one thing that's always going to make me laugh about the Pineville Heist is for the fact that there was a teaser trailer made for it. And in the teaser trailer, there's only one star. This guy. That's right, I starred in the teaser trailer of Lee Chambers' film Pineville Heist. You actually don't get to see any FaceTime, it's more of my back and then my chest and I'm holding a gun, but it's me. You get the feeling and you know it's me. So, to end it all off kind of thing, 
so if I've learned YouTube at all yet, there should be a link somewhere to Laura's Facebook page of her textile work. Then there should also be a link to Lee Chambers' Facebook page for Pineville Heist. And if I'm really tricky, there's a link to Lee Chambers' uh, teaser film for Pineville Heights. Alright, or maybe there's comments somewhere below. Fish kisses. Kisses. Get your butt out of my face. So to end it all off, guys, if you guys know any businesses that would be interested in donating merch to the uh, soon-to-be raffle draw, let me know. Bands that have a full-length or demo CD that they'd like to donate and get a new fan basis, let me know. And don't worry, guys, next week won't be just an update video. So, tune in next week uh, when the traveling Canadian nomad heads to the beach. That's right, we're heading to the beach. So, this has been the traveling Canadian nomad saying, I'll see you on the road, Canada. Hey, Gunter. I love it.